Hello everyone. Hello. Welcome to my channel. Come see me, Mama Flea. Hello. Hello. I would like to let you know, just as a disclaimer, that I am not a professional in all the stuff I do. I just pedal around my house and do it. So please do not listen to me. I forgot to say that a while ago. But anyhow, hello. So I just wanted to go over some of my little home, little projects that I go over because sometimes I just, I'm just all over the place. So here we go. This is a cucumber that has hung out too long and he has turned yellow. Can anyone tell me what we're supposed to do with this once this happens? Moving along, we have a uh, sun. We have dehydrated uh, yellow and red tomatoes. There's one. These are them up close. And then when I dehydrate them, I throw them inside of one of my empty spice containers. And yeah, I just have to have my stuff. And we have a few thing of green beans that I need to can as well today. But I'm going to try to do those with some tomatoes. Moving along, we have sage and oregano that has went to flour. So we're going to do this the same way. And we are going to... Uh, whoops. Something fell. Anyhow, we're going to do this the same way. So say, for instance, these little oregano pieces, we're going to take those off, put them in the same container like that Country Bob's. Same for the sage, this little curly. We're going to do that as well. There's a few more pieces of sage down in there. So, yeah, we're going to get all of these, all of that and put our little spices up. And then sometimes you might do it something like that. You can have it in one of those as well. That was maybe from a year ago. And let's see. Yeah, we put them in one of our empty little containers. Put that in there and boom, we're over with. Whoops. Stuff's falling and clicking. And this is um, some type of dried garlic. Dehydrated. When I say dried, I dehydrate my things. That was some garlic as well. So, yeah, I can't wait to mush some of this down and use it as seasoning. And let's see what else. And I have to dehydrate some more onions. But yeah, that's that's how that's going. And as far as the dehydrating, I probably dehydrate them a little bit too much. Because I don't want any moisture and then everything goes to hell. So until I can figure out how this actually and truly works, this is what's going to happen. I have um, some vodka that I am supposed to try to make some um, homemade vanilla extract with madagascar vanilla beans so i guess you're supposed to let that hang out in one of those jars that those green beans were in i guess and give it a couple shakes so i'll let you know but it, it takes it a while to hang out so i will definitely let you know last but not least is these tomatoes that i have been collecting either picking or either have gotten them through a uh, food pantry so I'm going to try to can those today since I only have two green beans to can I'm going to try to can the green beans and the tomatoes today and see how that works so I will definitely let you know how everything works so yeah it's not just about the food pantry it's the lifestyle you have to be more creative more natural um, definitely work the hand that you're given and that's it. So otherwise, everyone have a good rest of your week this week and the rest of your weekend. Have a good day. Bye now.